What's up YouTube? LTH coming at you with a Sunday video. So day three of the NFL draft is wrapped up and and it's officially on to the schedule release is what I'm ready for. But I'm gonna go, I'm gonna just go over the, the late round picks the Texans have selected and I'll get my thoughts on it. So and yes, Nick Casario once again found late round gems. And just like he did in day one and two. So the Texans selected Damian Pierce, running back out of Florida, who scored 13 touchdowns in his senior year. I mean, it's unfortunate that he never had a, had a thousand yard season, but he did get 13 touchdowns. And he's a pretty hard runner too, who scored the helmetless touchdown against Florida State. Another pick they got was Thomas Booker out of Stanford, D tackle. Because the Texans really did need a de defensive tackle to, if if they to enhance their chances of stopping a run. Yeah, it sucks that they missed out on Jordan Davis, but Thomas Booker pretty much helps. So feel the needs that the position of needs by the way so they selected thomas booker who had nine and a half sacks throughout his career in stanford and the texans also drafted a tight end out of oregon state tegan kitoriano he's more like a blocking tight end that the texans definitely needed i mean i wasn't surprised if they drafted a blocking tight end which I'm okay with because a blocking tight end can actually be effective, like a pass block or even a run game. And last but not least, the Texans selected Austin DeCullis out of LSU, offensive lineman. And like a, a another body foot protection when it comes to protecting Davis Mills because without an effective O-line, Mills is going to get sacked a tremendous amount of times. So I'm definitely okay with that. I mean, I wanted an edge rusher, but unfortunate that my Texans didn't get it, but it is what it is. Either way, Nick Casario did his thing into drafting the the needs that the Texans needed to draft and if I were to I mean I'm not saying I'm all the way right but if I were to grade the Texans NFL draft 2022 I'd give this an A minus for sure I mean yeah there, I mean like I said there were missed players that the Texans missed out on such as Kyle Hamilton and Jordan Davis but Hey, I got to get this team an A-, minus, man. Only thing that matters now is how these draft picks are going to pan out. And some of these players might start soon. And some of these players draft that we drafted may start a little later in the year. So, as the saying goes, only time will tell. Only time will tell. But other than that, I believe the Texans did. They did that thing. Nick Casario and Lovey Smith. But till my next video on our draft of rookies, I'm out.